for some of you, the Lord is asking you to submit to the death like Lazarus. You're in a Lazarus moment and your flesh is being crucified. There is a death of self that is being crucified right now. And we are in a season of transition. So this death to self is absolutely necessary and vital for you to submit to. And it's difficult to submit to this, this death, the death of Lazarus. The friends of Lazarus, Lazarus sisters, they were upset with Jesus that Lazarus had died, that they, they thought Jesus was late. But Jesus wasn't late. There was a reason and there was a timing and there was a purpose for the death of Lazarus. And Lazarus was dead for four days. Four days Lazarus was dead before the Lord raised him up. And some of you want to tiptoe into death and come right back out. You just want to dip your toe into death and then pull it right back out and receive this resurrection life. But that's not how it works. Lazarus was dead for four days. Four days represents completion. It represents dominion, power, resurrection, life, stability, governance. On the fourth day, the sun, moon, and the stars were created. The sun, moon, and the stars are, are the creation that God uses for time and governance of the earth. That is a part of dominion that God has over the earth. And in order for us to walk in that dominion, to walk in resurrection power, there has to be a full, complete death a four-day death, a complete fullness of death. Not a tiptoe, dip your toe, run away, pull back. You have to fully immerse yourself in death with the Lord Jesus Christ to be raised up with him to new life. And so right now, as you're in this transition phase, you are putting off your mortality and putting on his immortality, and on the fourth day, you will raise up, but you must surrender 